Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. The Russians conducted another massive uh, missile and drone attack on Ukraine last night, and uh, the Ukrainians destroyed, according to uh, their defense ministry, almost all these missiles, at least over Kiev. I think they destroyed all of them. This while the Secretary of State of the United States of America, Mr. Antony Blinken, is visiting Kiev. To do what? I'm going to cover that in a different uh, video. So let's see what the Ukrainians are saying about uh, the Russian attack. So some details here. So I'm going to start with this article first, coming from Ukrainska Pravda. Russians attack Kiev with missiles of various types and air defense destroys destroys all targets. Isn't that fantastic? All targets were destroyed. Do you believe that? All right, then. Give me $20,000 by tomorrow and I will give it to you back in the next day with an interest of 3,000%. Okay? And I'll meet you the next day giving you back the money. <laughs> yeah, okay. All of them. Not impossible. Very unlikely. Or at least unlikely. Russian forces launched a combined attack on Kiev on the night of 5 and 6 of September. Today is the 6th of September 2023. Using KH-101, 555 and 55 cruise missiles and other types, probably ballistic missiles. So, uh, another Russian missile attack on peaceful city with the aim of killing the civilian population. And destroying Papa Pay Boop Boop Boop. Okay, preliminary information indicates that Russian Tupelov 95 MS strategic bombers launched KH 101 555 cruise missiles from Saratov Oblast. At the same time, missiles of a different type, probably ballistic, were launched over Kiev. Ukrainian air defense forces and assets destroyed all targets moving towards the capital. Provisional information indicates that there were no casualties or destruction in Kiev. I think the Russians should stop doing it then. Why don't I call Putin and say, hey, these guys are destroying all your missiles, you just waste money. Why don't you try something else? All right, yeah, okay. The Air Force will publish official pub -bub. Okay, so this is the first one. So all of them over Kiev. Kiev is safe. Thank God. Let's go to the next article coming from the new voice of Ukraine. September 6, 2023, Ukraine intercepts 23 out of the 33 airborne targets in overnight Russian attack Ukraine air forces. And we have to add, based on or according to this article, all of them destroyed over Kiev. All right, why? Because we have Patriot systems over there. Now you know why. Buy one, get one free. That's a new sales over there. Uh, Russia's latest cruise and ballistic missiles attack on Ukraine pop up up. Okay, it was rather natural, and I'm quoting, if I may put it that way, attack from the occupiers, this was nightmare, uh, nighttime assault launching from an evening hours and transitioning into the next day from 11 p.m. with various flight routes, they said. So the missile launch area has been moved further west from the Caspian Sea to Russia's Eagles 2 military airbase cruise missiles pop up pop, pop launched from angles angles uh, in the early hours of september 6 were preliminary intercepted over central ukraine one ballistic missile was also intercepted they call it now ballistic instead of saying that it's a um, kinzal i think that's what they what they mean but they don't want to say kinzal because kinzal is a hypersonic and then they say just one ballistic missile okay anyway the ukrainian air forces successfully intercepted 23 out of 33 airborne targets in the september 6 overnight attack now i have uh, some questions first if the russians uh, realize that this is true and their missiles are ineffective in kiev why don't they try why do they why do they keep trying i'm talking and uh well, that's the first one i mean it's the waste of money and the second observation that i have is the russians still have missiles now i don't know if you remember but i do remember that last year was it in i think it was in april at the beginning of april the british said then there were the russians are almost done with their missiles so they're running very low on that where very low means what uh, maybe 10%, 7% or 
of their stockpile uh, is there and what 80 90 93 whatever uh, done and since then the russians kept bombarding these guys so someone is uh, lying well no surprise here so this is the new uh, missile attack only from those uh, um, Tupelo of 95, I think it was 95, um, bombers, nothing from uh, the Black Sea. They don't, didn't mention anything about submarines or vessels in the Black, uh, located in the Black Sea. But we're going to come maybe with some uh, more details when uh, the Ukrainians provide us. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.